The COVID-19 pandemic has packed a big punch. If it wasn't tragic enough that many lives have been lost because of the virus, now there are people who aren't getting life insurance policies paid out because of the pandemic. Fox 2's Vic Faust takes a look at, take, talks it over, I'm sorry, talks it over with Brown and Crouppen attorney Andrea McNary. Last week, Andrea, we talked about knowing your insurance policy, what you have, what you really need to have. This week, we take it a step further. People think they know what they have with their insurance policy on life insurance, and then COVID hits, and unfortunately, they experience a tragedy and then find out what, we're not covered. What's going on right now? Social media has been a buzz with life insurance claims being denied for COVID. In reality, I found few um, actual substantiated claims of this, but I did find some. And again, under, uh, there's two reasons we're really seeing denials. And one is definitional exclusions. And two is the material misrepresentations. What if this has happened to somebody where they've lost a loved one and they're in the middle of this situation right now? What I advise everybody to do is one, you need to read your policy. Um, when I talk about definitional exclusions, I'm talking about parts of your policy that say what is covered and what isn't. And usually they're termed exclusions, but if you see an exclusion in your policy that says act of God, infectious disease, or pandemic, and it excludes those items or those issues or situations, um, then you know you need to change your coverage or find a new life insurance company. When I'm talking about material misrepresentations, I'm talking about you forgot to disclose maybe a comorbidity that the insurance company can argue within the contestability period affected your ability to fight off the COVID virus resulting in death. So what I would advise people to do there is make sure you're being honest about all health conditions. Just because she didn't find a lot of life insurance claims being denied doesn't mean it's not happening. I did find substantiated circumstances of this of this um, actually occurring. So, you know, it leads back to what we discussed last week, Vic, which is make sure you're reviewing your policy regularly and making sure the policy fits what your needs are at the time. Vic Faust, Fox 2 News. On next week's Legal Lens, we'll break down the specifics of the new law signed by Governor Parson regarding COVID liability.